Thank you very much. It's my honor and privilege to act as the conference chair for LEAD Convention 2022. This is a platform through which serving and aspiring non-executive directors, board appointing authorities and key leaders and partners from different backgrounds and expertise can meet, discuss and distill concepts, ideas and narratives that enhance the effectiveness in their respective roles, contexts and areas of influence. Welcome to LEAD Convention 2022. In progress on these items will not be possible without the support of each one of you. Not just the support of LEAD members, but the support of key stakeholders across all sectors. We value your insights, we value your partnership, and we hope that we can continue to build LEAD together. I thank you very much. I hope you have a wonderful day and I'll hand back to Jackie. Thank you very much. The new digital era requires a new kind of board member, requires and demands a new kind of environment in the boardroom, a new kind of interaction between board members and management, and most importantly, requires of you, the board member, to be fit for the future. I believe that if something is worth doing, it's worth doing right. So if you're approached to say, please come and be a board member, and you choose to, give it your best. Give it your time. Uh, Justin was talking about learning new things. Because, yeah, you will not know everything, but once you decide I'm getting on board, read, find things out, so that you give your best to this. Because you have chosen to take it up, otherwise don't. Businesses are people, you know, at the end of the day, it's all about who is in the room. So, you know, who are you choosing on your management table? How do they influence the direction of the business? But more importantly, who are the board members? The main part of board is actually driving the strategy. Coming up with a vision, with a mission that will then drive the entity forward. But that has to be delivered if there is a little bit of time for them to be able to then run with the show. I just wanted to conclude with, uh, um, with just encouraging each of us to, to, to reflect on, 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 our, on our different responsibilities and roles. And, and many times it takes a high degree of emotional intelligence. We need to continuously learn and <clears throat> try and grow our level of emotional intelligence, in particular reference to self-awareness. And so one of the things that board members to look, have to look out for and maybe management is as you run at these things that come at you every other day, unexpected. I think you need to create a pool somewhere who are sheltered from the headwinds and are seated doing their thing in a perfect way so that we don't stop having these very well done things. Because well done things really look good. I would like to stop there for a moment. Thank you. <laughs> really like to thank UDP, uh, UDC, NSSF, UBA, UBL, Stambik Bank, and the CEO of Forum for agreeing to partner with us uh, on this noble corporate cause to support LEAD to make this uh, conference a success. And thank, uh, thanks to all the subject matter experts who have given justice uh, to this theme. Uh, my big brother, Francis Akamulegea, and of course, uh, PK, uh, the, the impact you've had as well to energize us, and the rest of the panelists uh, for the uh, words of wisdom that you've shared with everyone. So on behalf of KPMG, uh, our colleague sponsors and lead, we thank all the directors who have made time for this conference, and we trust that your participation has given you a competitive advantage over the rest of your competitors who have not made time for this. I thank you all.